Okay, is that all the trainers on this route? I don't think it is. You a trainer? Yep, you are. Research, research! I shall research the Pokemon! Okay, what do you say? You're challenged by scientist Tyrone. Okay, this person also has two Pokemon. Amara? Amara? Okay. Interesting looking Pokemon. It's like a dinosaur. No idea what it is. Not very effective. It must be a ground type. Or a bean. Apparently super effective. Well, let's do this again and it'll die. No? It did more than half its health last time though. Whatever. Interesting cry that Pokemon makes as well. Scientist Tyrone is about to send out Omanyte? No, I don't, I don't want to switch. I don't know if you know what an Omanyte is. Oh, it's that thing. I've seen that before. Well, I haven't, not in this game, but I know I've, I've seen that in previous Pokemon games. There we go. And we gained XP. I present the results of my research. This person's Pokemon strong. And yet, he paid less. The children are the ones that pay all the money. What's this that's weird sounds? There's this dude near here who says that he wants to make a whole theme park full of nothing but Pokemon restored from fossils. Oh. Is it here? Fossil Restoration Center. Let's make a fossil-filled wonderland. Welcome to the Dream Park, where dreams become reality and fossils become Pokemon. Someday this whole place is going to be filled with bur to filled to bursting with Pokemon from the ancient past. That's my dream for this, the Dream Park, to bring the ancient world back to life. You you're, so you got Jurassic Park going on over here? Sounds good. A rare bone. All right, let's take a look at the, the, the items I wanted to take a look at. Okay, I think we've got that earlier. <sighs> Miracle seed. Uh, it boosts grass type moves, okay. And rare bone. Sold for a high price. Okay, so let me give this Miracle seed to my dupe hider since it has bug type moves. <clears throat> I think that was that's what makes the most sense. Oh, hello. Thanks for the sticker. All right, I guess there's nothing for me to do here yet. Is that all the trainers? I think that's all the trainers, so I should probably be able to go back to that person. <clears throat> hey, hey, salad! You ever heard of that Festival Plaza thing? I guess it's like a festival or something where lots of people get together and have fun? You, I can tell you've been to Festival Plaza before. Festival Plaza seems pretty good, huh? I don't remember which what Festival Plaza was. Was it the thing that got trapped in in his multiplayer? Even my old Gramps tried it out. It's great to meet so many different folks. Now I'm gonna have to go, now I'm gonna go have some fun with my team. All right, you go do that, Hal. All right, let me out of here. Um, I'm going to charge on back and talk to that person again. You wanted me to battle everybody. It was you, right? <laughs> you there. In battle, the sky's the limit. Are you ready to send your opponent to the at into the atmosphere? What do you say? Might you be interested in the move Sky Drop? Uh, oh, I, I thought I beat everyone here. I guess I didn't Sky Drop. I mean, I have flying types. Wow, Daddy, I want to know more about Orangu. Orangaroo. Oh, uh, what should I do? Is there something, someone with a Orangaroo? Uh, I don't, I don't have one, sorry. 
<clears throat> Wah! Yeah, okay. So they need a Ranga Good to know. Uh, who did I not battle? I am confused. I definitely battled you. There's no one that way. I already battled you. I have to get off of Tauros. I already battled you. What am I missing? Oh, can I go into the water? No, I can't. I guess I can fish. But I don't think this has anything to do with the trainers here. Come on, keep going. I want to at least see what's here. See if it's another magic harp. You never know. Okay, a pearl. That's not what I was looking for. Looking for a Pokemon here. Okay. Apparently not a very popular place for Pokemon. Okay, if it's a magic card, then we're we're fleeing again. <sighs> okay. <sighs> magic carps everywhere. Okay, so that's cool and all, but this this route that I'm on. <clears throat> I didn't want to talk to you. No, I want to see the map. Show me the map. Okay, finally, let me see the map. So if I zoom in, I want to know where, where this route supposedly ends. Is it like, is it not? Have I not reached the end of it yet? This whole part is Route 8 then? Route 8, Route 8, Route 8. About 5. Yeah, Route 8 ends basically where I was, where I reached. Maybe it goes just a little bit farther, fine. Let's zoom on through. I didn't talk to you, right? Pretty sure I did. Okay. Hello, child. Are you a Pokemon trainer? <clears throat> my bro is super strong at Pokemon, you know? I borrowed my bro's Pokemon without asking, actually. But do you want to have a battle? Sure. Heh. <laughs> I'll beat you no sweat. Okay. You're challenged by preschooler Caleb. Well, even if your Poke- your- Brothers Pokemon are strong, you only got one of them. Kingish Kingish Gun? Yo Cha. Yep. Doesn't look like this is gonna be enough to survive. I'm sorry. Bonk! Want to learn to move bite? Maybe? So bug bite or regular bite? This is 63 power, 100 accuracy. That may make them flinch. 60 power, 100 accuracy uses, it takes the berry. I think we don't want to learn bite. It doesn't match either of it, the dew powder's type. It's not water or bug. And so it's gonna be Necessarily weaker than bug bite, especially since I have the thing equipped that I do. And I don't want to learn remove my water type moves either. Keep old moves. No, my big bro's Pokemon. What? 
Why? My first Pokemon is super strong. Why did I lose? Thank you. Oh no. Hey, big bro. You brought my Pokemon out again without asking, didn't you? I I'm sorry. It looks like you got soundly defeated too. Yeah, but all your Pokemon are super strong, big bro. I don't get why. Even if they have potential, if you don't let them fight properly, Pokemon can't unleash their full power. You can only understand how strong your Pokemon are by giving them love and attention on a daily basis. I, I, unfortunately, I don't do that to both my Pokemon. I'm sorry. If you want to win with a borrow, with borrowed Pokemon, you need to train yourself too. I always blade my Pokemon when I lose against friends. But that's what I, what's been preventing me from becoming strong. I'm gonna spend more time with my own Pokemon, and promise I'll, and I promise I'll beat you together with them, bro. <laughs> I won't let you win easily. Okay. Sorry you had to get tingled up in this weird situation. Take this for your troubles. A lumberry. Well, I mean, I I accepted the offer to fight, so it was no trouble for me, and I even took the the preschooler's money. Right, I'll race you back home. Yeah, I'll see you around. All right, off they go, I guess. So did that count as the person needed to? Nope. It's another one here. The swing is all on the hips. I'll put my hips into it when I take you on. Oh, okay. You'll put your hips into it when you take me on, huh? It's a very sus thing to say, but you're challenged by golfer. Mile? How really hard pronounced names. Don't know what it's how it's supposed to be pronounced. Golfer Miles sent out what? A Natu, I think it was. Yeah, Natu. Well, let's just aerial ace it and be done with it. Bye bye, little birdie. I'm sorry. Gaining level so fast. There's another one. Even I can triumph, so, triumph over myself in golf when it comes to triumphing over my opponent in a match. Received money for winning. Okay. What do we got here? Another person to train with. Sorry, I'm gonna steal your golf ball. When it comes to golf or Pokemon, it's all about perform the performance. You're challenged by golfer Alan. Hootoot. Okay. Well, I've got an owl type Pokemon as well. Although I haven't been using it. Bye bye. What a miss! My performance was absolutely terrible! Well, you didn't get to have a performance, I'm sorry. Found a dive ball, okay. Guess that could come in handy someday. Once again. We want more water Pokemon. Hello. Those Wimpod always run away before I can nab one. And even if you catch up to one, they still try to distract you by dropping items they've gathered around. They've gathered, and they run away again. Hmm. But is Wimpod? I mean, you would think that Wimpod, because it's always running away, would be a really weak Pokemon. But what if it isn't? <laughs> That's what I don't know. Maybe uh, it's such a strong Pokemon, and it would be good to have one. And it's just hard to get because of the fact that it runs away. That's kind of what I'm expecting. Thanks for waiting. Halucha and the best of your team should be all better now. Alright. Actually, I should probably see what's for sale there. Um, but before I do... Just see my Pokemon around again. We're gonna have, um, Dartrix in the f Or maybe... No, we're, we're putting Doofpyre in the front again. Still, I'm not totally convinced that the person at the front of the party doesn't get most of the XP. Also, what are you doing here? 
Burble, burble, burble indeed. Naturally, there are a lot of grass type Pokemon in Lush Jungle. You know the types strong against grass? Fire, flying, and bug, to name a few. Hmm. But grass is strong against water, which is a problem as well. Um, Alright, what do you sell? Useless stuff, cool. Um, but I can sell some of my useless stuff, right? Like an X speed, we don't need that. Pearls, let's sell those. And more pearls. Hopefully I don't randomly need a pearl in the future. I could see that happening. They just said that they, um... That they're good for selling to high price to shops. But I'm hoping that's the only use they have. There's also the rare bone, but I'm gonna keep that just in case. Okay, let's get out of here. Now, surely, at this point, that person should be ready to battle, right? Yeah, you. Um, do I want to fight you with Dewpider? I guess we'll try. What? It's still not every trainer? You're kidding me. Who did I miss? I don't get it. This isn't down here a different area now? The reason that Malo is always looking for the best ingredients in Lush Jungle is actually because she wants to make Olivia say once and for all that her cooking is the best. Okay. Oh, hello. That's that Pokemon that runs away. Okay, maybe there's somebody over here to battle. Looks like there is. Oh, an item. <sighs> Not interested in a wing ball. No, I keep doing that. No, I keep doing that. Here we go. Wait, we can't get away. I forget because we have Dewpiter as our first Pokemon. And I think it's very rude that you hurt Dewpider that much. Switch to Dartrix. Missed. Does that make it harder for me to hit you? for help. It's fine. I'm pretty sure Razor Leaf hits both, right? Yeah. And the other one's lower level, so it should just die. Nice. We gained a level. Now, my, I'm curious. If we gain a level in the middle of an attack like this, does the second part of the attack uh, benefit from the increased attack and defense and whatnot? Synthesis. That's like a healing type move, right? What does that do? User restores its own HP. The amount of HP regained varies with the weather. I don't know if I really like that. I mean, there, there are probably some game modes where you can't use external items to heal. Um, in which case, having a healing move would be very useful. Like, I think the... Probably the battle arena, you probably can't use healing items in. Except for like berries and stuff like that. But would I even want to bother? I don't know if I care. I feel like I'd rather just... Rem I mean, I, I have some moves that I can get rid of, I guess. I can get rid of Astonish. I guess I'll get rid of Astonish. 
because I don't think I'll I'd be using that move long term. But I don't think I'll be using Synthesis that much either, so whatever. Oh no, the move stopped! I thought Razor Leaf was supposed to attack both at once. Yeah, because I can't select a specific person. I'm confused. Like, the move stopped in the middle of itself. It was supposed to attack both, I thought. Whatever. A water stone, okay. More things to help evolve an Eevee. I forget, did I get an Eevee or not? I don't remember. I feel like I did, but maybe I didn't. I could probably check, huh? Yeah, we did have an Eevee. Right, I forgot where we got it, but we have an Eevee, so we can evolve it to, into whatever type we want. I don't know what type I would want to, but I'm sure there's something. I'm trained it together with the genius next to me in order to beat him. I was born a karate genius. I need to move to my Pokemon. You're saying that the, the child is the karate genius and you're training to beat your child? Very odd thing to say. Anyways. A challenge by Karate fam Family Samuel and Guy. Alright, so they got fighting types. I've got Pokemon that are way under leveled. Wonderful. Um, I think I'm going to want to switch out Dupider before it dies. To Cha. And then Finian will give it a shot. Will uh, They will do a Ghost, I guess? Against the higher level one or lower level one? I guess the lower level one. Ow! It's a critical hit. Uh, well, there goes my fish. Bye-bye, fish. Guess we're gonna get my two main Pokemon out here. Alright, now it's time for them to die. So I guess we'll use Aerial Ace on... This one, Dartrix will use Pluck on that one. Probably not the right move to make, but whatever. Because Dartrix might not be able to one-shot the other one. Never mind, doesn't matter. Yeah, I like double battles like that. Those are fun. I keep a smile even when my, my Pokemon, even when my Pokemon and I lose. It reassures my Pokemon. Master, sorry. Hmm, I've got further to devote myself to my karate. If you're strong, be just. I bow my head to my young partner. So yeah, okay. That is that is what they're what they're about. Apparently the child is the master. Why do, why do I even bother? Why am I even bothering with this? It's just gonna be another freaking Magikarp. Oh, Remoraid. No, this is new. We've never we never found one of these before. We'll catch it. Um, I'm kind of weak here though, but let me switch to Mile. Bonk. Hey, I got confused, but that doesn't matter too much. As long as I don't hurt myself in confusion. Okay, good. 
lock on so that I don't miss. So that it doesn't miss. I don't think uh, you should be worried about missing. And also, if I fly, I wonder if I, if my Pokemon used fly, would it still miss? <laughs> would the other Pokemon still miss if they used lock on? Or like dig? I feel like they would. Using lock on twice in a row, that's really odd. Okay, go ahead and call for help, sure. Alright, let's just use a Great Ball. That should be enough. Really helpful to have False Swipe. Such a good quality of life thing. I think it is a bit of a waste for me to be using Mile just for that. But, even so, <laughs> I just... I need, I need that to be a thing so that I can catch all the Pokemon I want to catch. It's, it's, it's necessary. Okay, so does Remoraid evolve? It does, it evolves once. We have so many fish to choose from now. Um, Jet Pokemon, also known as the Sniper of the Seas. Its water gun can hit prey without fail from over 300 feet away. Cool. Uh, we'll leave it to you. We'll, we'll leave it in the box for now. I've already got lots of fish I'm upgrading or whatever. Alright, surely, surely now that was everybody in this area and now they'll, they'll fight me, right? Also, before I do that though, I'm gonna need a, <laughs> I'm gonna need to heal up so that I don't die. We'll do that real quick. Okay. Get out of here. Please. Surely I'm done. Okay. <sighs> Jeez, it's so difficult to find everybody. But we found everybody. So let's see what this person has to has to say. Jones by Ace Trainer Aline. Uh, aliens send out fi- I don't know what that is, but it's a bird. Flying is strong against bugs, so this could be a problem. Uh, in fact, I think it is a problem. I'm gonna use infestation just because, but I think I might just die here. Okay, almost. Yeah, it's not very effective. It's only doing like Oh, okay, that was a little bit of damage, I guess. So let's switch out. There we go. Switch in Cha as usual. This is probably not the most effective attack against it, but it doesn't matter. Yeah. Bye bye. Two fighters gaining levels, good. Fish is gaining levels. Payback. Uh, I guess that does more damage based on how much damage you take. The user stores power that attacks. If the user moves after the target, this attack's power will be doubled. If the user moves after the target, so it does 100 damage. If the attack comes out later? Um, so let's compare that to some other moves that it has. Switcheroo. Trades held items. Attack. Foul play we obviously want to keep because it's just a strong move. Um, and then hypnosis. That makes him sleep, right? I think I like all of these moves except for these. I don't like these two as much. Peck is kind of weak. And Switcheroo, it's got some utility to it. I don't know when I'll need that though, because I don't have like an item that I want to switch to somebody else yet. But for now, I think I'm gonna get rid of Peck. Oh, sorry. I do wanna. I do wanna forget a move. I'm gonna forget Peck because Peck is super weak. 
as an attack. There we go. Hero. Will I switch? Uh, you know what? Sure. Let's give Dartrix some time to shine. I'm just worried that Sha will overlevel itself and then not listen to me again. That's what I'm most concerned with. Um, is Grass not gonna be good against a bird? I don't even remember. And then Omnis Wind is what again? Let's use Omnis Wind. That was apparently super effective. It doesn't affect. So Ghost type doesn't work because it's normal. The normal type. Oh no, we're gonna die, huh? Mm hmm. Jeez. It's been a while since one of my Pokemon died like that. We're gonna switch to. Um... Yeah. We're gonna do this. Let me see if I can make this strategy work. It just depends on if I can survive, like, an attack or two. I can use double team. Okay, well, there go so much for surviving an attack or two. Super Sonic Sky Strike? Well, it's lagging too much, so I can't see what this is happening, but okay. They're just using fly, basically. And lagging the game to death. Okay, it wasn't very effective, good. I'm surprised I survived that. Miles, just great, I guess. Now, they have Aerial Ace, though, which makes this, what I'm doing, kind of pointless here, I know. Because Aerial Ace doesn't miss. I just want to see how viable this tactic is, and it seems it's, it's pretty viable. Miles not dying very fast. Then we can use Baton Pass. But it doesn't happen immediately, so that's kind of tough. Okay, good. I can pick who I switch to. Then we switch to... I'll try Inkay. Now Inkay should be hard to hit as long as they don't use Aerial Ace. Um, and then I'm going to use Payback and try that out. Now, now I use Payback. How much does that do? A decent amount. Not as much as I would really hope, but... Let's try um, our Foul Play now. Okay, use Pursuit, but we... Oh, we had a berry. I'm surprised it didn't miss. Because that wasn't a real ace. There we go. Gaining levels. My swelling feelings, they followed right to the bottom. A lot of money for that. Alright, well, I'm. Uh, so, should I stop Dewpider from evolving? This is what I don't know. I feel like. I feel like I should be looking up these Pokemon to figure out, like, some of the actual more detailed meta info on them before I, like, continue on with, like, whether they should evolve or they should not evolve. I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm going to look up real quick some info on Dewpider. So let me do that real right now. So Dewpider. Okay. So I don't... I, I, if I'm reading this right, I don't see any moves that I necessarily care too much about. That it learns um, only as regular Dewpider, not as its evolved form. So I will let it evolve. Um, but one thing that I did uh, notice that was a bit interesting is that it can learn ice moves. So that's curious. And there are certain moves that it only learns just from being, coming out of an egg, if you're lucky. So that's good to know. But we're letting it evolve. There we go. Aquanid, or Ar 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 Araquanid. Wonderful. Add to the Pokedex. Cool. 
Hot diggity, look at you. You're on fire, partner. You fire filled in all the Pokedep Mon on a single page. Um, it has a habit of storing things it values in its water bubble. If its trainer doesn't watch out, the Aquarin... Aquarin... Araquanid... Araquanid... will try to put them in its bubble. Good to know. Awesome. Well, that's the end of me and my Pokemon Z-powered performance. Oh, and uh, our Pokedex is talking to us, but it's too fast. Awesome photo. I know I don't want to. I don't want to make take photos. No thanks. Thanks for taking part in the show. Take this with you as a souvenir. Sky drop. Okay, now we can actually see what this is. I bet you can find other trainers who use this use particular moves and items just like me on the various routes of Alola. Wouldn't it be fun to take a little detour and search them all out? Yeah, I mean, that is sort of what I've been doing, but let me take a look at that move. I can... Mario can learn Charge Beam? Interesting. Um, Alright, Sky Drop. The user uh, takes the target into the sky, then drops it during the next turn. The target cannot attack while in the sky. Interesting. So if you're fast enough and are able to attack first every turn, the target will never be able to do anything? Do I understand that right? Is that how that works? All right, since we're already in the Googling train, let me look that up and see what that means. TM58, Sky Drop. I need to see what this does. Brings the target into the air. Target cannot act. Both the user and the target avoid any move targeted at them. Oh, I see. So on the next turn, that everyone comes down though, and that's when the damage happens. And then that other Pokemon could technically still attack. So either way, you are gonna- you're not avoiding damage with this. Yeah, okay, so you're not- you're still not avoiding damage with this, because once you come down, they're gonna be able to attack you after that. Alright, then I- I don't- I don't care as much. All right, let's get out of here. One final rest up at this station. And then we'll continue on. All right, we're gonna teach Growlithe. Um, we're, gonna, we're, gonna, we're gonna put Growlithe on our team and teach them uh, this flame charge move. Yeah, there we go. Just because we're apparently gonna need fire types going through here let's see how that goes <clears throat> five lush jungle okay but i guess i can go check out this area first right what do we got going on here oh where are you another diglet yeah, another big lit. That's fine. Let's try our new aqua aqua araquanid. Let's try our new araquanid on it. Uh, we'll use a bubble on it. I think we do need a few, some more strong moves though to learn. Oh, we flinched and couldn't move. Some strong water type moves. Here we go. Drop down. Oh, I shouldn't have dropped down twice. Not what I wanted to do. Okay, there's a lot going on here. I kind of want to use Repel. I think I will. I'm not interested in running into enemies. I 
wish it was simpler to activate a repel. Wait, have I been here before? I feel like I have. It seems super familiar. Yeah. Yeah, I've been here before. I think I made a mistake. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I see where I am. Fine. Let me take my Charizard and fly back. I'm sure I can do that. Okay, this time, we're only gonna drop down once. More diglets. Hello, child. Come fight me. Alola, I'm Caleb. Let's give each other a look at our Pokemon. Mr. Caleb. Charge a bug? What the heck is that? It looks like a van. It looks like a bus. This is a really weird looking Pokemon. Um. So it's a bug type. Is water strong against it? I'd assume it's a bug type at least. Um, I guess I'll use Infestation. Try that. Spark! Oh, it's Electric type? That's scary. Okay, so it's an Electric Bug. Interesting. Mm, I guess we're gonna have to switch out or heal, right? I guess we'll just heal? I don't know how many like strong potions I have. Surprised it didn't use any electric attacks earlier. It was just doing bug things. Acrobatics? Apparently that's super effective. I guess that's a flying type? Um, let's just do a bug bite. Let's just finish it off, right? Ow. Right, we're paralyzed still. Alright, we're using up another potion. That's what we have them for, so. It's gonna die to the infestation soon anyways. How does that thing move like that? <laughs> and it's dead. Okay. That works. Gained a level. Your Pokemon, so cool! Yeah, I agree, it is pretty cool. Got no money for winning. Okay, now we need to fix up our Pokemon again, so let's do that. Okay, I'm just pressing the wrong buttons over and over again. Ignore me. Heal the paralysis. And spam potions. Okay. Yeah, let's keep using more repels. Oh, hello, trainer. 
Here I go! You're challenged by Ace Trader Alexis. He's got two Pokemons. Two Pokemans. Gloomy. Oh, that's the Pokemon that we uh, need to get, right? We have to get that Pokemon for some reason. Um, Bubble Bean, maybe? I don't know what that move does, but... Not very effective, okay. Water's not effective against it. Then we'll use Infestation. Storing energy still, okay. It's kind of scary. That was a critical hit. All right, hopefully it's still storing energy. Ow. We'll just chomp it. Yeah, our Araquanid doesn't have any uh, true killing moves yet, it seems. Uh, Sylveon? Sure, I guess we'll switch. Let's try, it out, try, try it out, let's try out our Growlithe. I'm trying to speak here. I don't know what a Sylveon is, but we'll find out. Is that one of the Eevee evolutions, maybe? I don't really know. Might burn. May burn. Raises speed. Okay, I think we'll just use Flame Wheel. Not very effective, okay. I guess that's a healing move. Alright, that didn't do much. What does the reversal do? More powerful the less HP you have? Okay, we'll save that. Maybe we should have used it. I'm just hoping this leaves a burn. It doesn't. Okay, so we're gonna have to switch out again. In K time. Trying to give other Pokemon a spotlight that aren't Shaw. And I guess I'll use the usual foul play. How dare you. Okay, that was apparently super effective, good to know. And that was a full heal. Wow. Oh, uh, I know I, I can't I can't switch into you. All right, Dartrix then. Don't really know what type of Pokemon this is. Fairy type, maybe? If it is, I don't know what that means. Um, Ominous Wind, maybe? That's not the move to use either. Uh, Pluck? You weak against flying types? Not really. Alright, we'll just use Pluck again. Gaining levels? Fire Fang. I'm sure, I'm sure there's another fire move we can remove. Probably Ember, right? That does 40 damage. 65 damage, less accuracy. The user bites the Flame Cloak Fangs. May also make the tar target flinch or leave a burn. Yeah, that's a good one. So we'll uh, replace Ember then. Cool. It's over! What do we get? Hyper Potion. Nice.
Is that item up there, how do I get that? Oh, hello. Oh wait, my Pokemon's still dead. So, what do you think of the largeness of my area? You mean the area you're standing in? I don't know. I have no feelings one way or the other. Hiker Gabriel. Two Pokemon, huh? Maki Makuhita. Or something. Araquanid! Wait, I thought Araquanid was dead. I guess not. Um, in that case, we're gonna have to start by healing, which is kind of unfortunate. Or maybe we just switch. I think this time, instead of wasting all our consumables, let's just switch to Cha. Whirlwind. What? Does that switch out the Pokemon we have? Oh, okay. But you can't do that indefinitely. Surely you won't do that again. What? Is that all you're gonna do? Okay, sent out a different Pokemon this time though, so that's fine. Um, Fairy Wind is apparently super effective? Okay, let's see if we can even get that move out though. Okay, we can. Jeez. Force Palm. Okay, they decided to attack now. Um, let's do double team. Oh, you jerk. Why can't you just miss? But at least Cha came out. Now you're just dead. Mudbray. No, I will not switch. It's a really heavy one, right? Let's just use a bounce. It's been a while since we used bounce. Bonk! There we go. Four, gain a bunch of stats. Whoa, a large scale trainer. I guess it's a large scale trainer to have a full team of Pokemon instead of just one or two. Guess that's not normal. Full heal. Okay. No, oh, is it another Diglett? I still haven't leveled my Pokemon, or healed my Pokemon yet. But whatever. We'll see if we can manage to kill it in a bubble beam. Earthquake. Speed fell. We were too slow anyways, so that doesn't do anything. Good, Dartrix is gaining levels. And this is a TM, right? Brutal Swing. Okay, what does that do? The user swings its body around violently to inflict damage on everything in its vicinity. It's a dark type move. Okay, it doesn't seem to do anything special except just do damage. I don't care too much, but that's neat to have, I guess. No, it's, I didn't want to fly. Sorry, sorry, I didn't want to do that. I just want to go heal up my Pokemon real quick. And then we'll finally head in the main objective. The, whatever that cave is. No, 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 I, oh, okay. I accidentally used a repel. I didn't want to accidentally, I didn't want to use another, another repel, but whatever. Again, we'll heal up. 
Maybe I should buy some more repels, but whatever. Doesn't matter. Just go onwards with the trial. Okay, finally. Finally move on the jungle. Thanks for stopping by. Welcome to Lush Jungle, the trial grounds for me, Malo. You ready to get in some hot water? My trial's ready for you if you're ready for it. Oh wait, oh actually, hold on, I'm not ready yet. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, I need to switch my Pokemon around in this case, I forgot. We're gonna need to have like fire type stuff going on. So let's switch in Growlithe to be the first one. Give them some experience. Okay, we're ready. I knew it the first time I saw you and your team. You've chosen only the finest ingredients. You're the only one who got a sparkling stone straight from Tapu Koko, aren't you? I totally get it now. Okay then, here in your lush jungle, it's time for Malo's trial to begin. Trial start! Ah, the breath of the jungle. I can tell just what today's special should be. Yep, it's gotta be. My secret specialty, the Super Malo Special. I'm gonna need you to find three ingredients for me. I'll need a, mong a, a mago berry, some honey, and a big root. Here you go, I bought you a forage bag to hold all the ingredients together for your trial. Well, I already have some honey. If you just tossed all the trial ingredients in your own bag, it would make something all right. Something like a model of mess, I guess. Let's go and find the first ingredient right away. Okay, so I can't use the ones that are already from my bag. That would make no sense if I could. Huh? What are those? Geez, those Fomantis, I wonder if they could tell how strong you are. You can find Mago Berries around here. But you'll also find Fomantis living here because they love Mago Berries too. If you take a Mago Berry that the Fomantis have their eyes on, they might not take too kindly. When you're done gathering ingredients here, just let me know. And as usual, I, I'm sure I can't um, catch them. A sweet scent is wafting up from the sap driven to the tree trunk where you pick the Mago Berry? Yes. Okay, so we already got the berry. Yeah, we're gonna keep using repels. Super potion. So we have to get a separate Mago Berry from every separate tree? Do I want this one instead? Wait, does it matter? What was the point in that? Huh? I don't get it. Sure, I guess I'll pick it up again. How can you put up the berry back where you found it? <laughs> you can't like put it back on the, the vine it was growing on. It's, seems a little bit pointless. I'm just very confused. So about that ingredient, you sure it's the one you want to grab? If any Pokemon had their eyes on it, you might be taking something the Pokemon thinks belongs to them. And then they may come attack you later. I'll be fine. It's on to the next ingredient. Chop chop, let's keep moving. Okay, I guess we're choosing... Which one they cared about or didn't care about? I don't know. Did, did neither of them care about that berry? I'm confused. You can harvest honey from the flowers that bloom here in the jungle, but you'll also find plenty of Pokemon where there are lots of flowers. When you find the ingredients you're sure you want, come show them to me, okay? 